You can save thousands of dollars at the dentist by avoiding these three things. And I'm not even gonna mention refined sugars because your dentist already told you about that one. First and foremost, you should actually know it's normal to not have cavities. However, our modern diet has changed this and a number of things that we consume today demineralize or remove minerals like calcium from the hard tissues on our teeth. This then leads to tooth decay. To avoid this, you wanna be cautious of the following. First is phytic acid. Phytic acid is found in nuts, grains, seeds, legumes, and tubers, and it binds to minerals like calcium, which, as you know, makes your bones and teeth stronger. I'm not telling you these foods are bad for you, but you should soak, sprout, ferment, or cook these first to reduce their amount of phytic acid. People who consume large amounts of phytic acid generally have more tooth decay, and in this study, those who avoided phytic acid and supplemented vitamin D actually healed cavities. Second is phosphoric acid. Food-grade phosphoric acid is used to acidify and preserve foods and drinks. It's in things like Coca-Cola, which can literally take the rust off the metal. Just imagine what it's doing to your teeth. And third is controversial, and you won't find this on Google, but it's sodium fluoride. Ironically, this is found in our tap water and in our toothpaste. Today, we're overexposed to fluoride, and because it easily binds with calcium and about half of ingested fluoride is stored in the bones, about 40% of teens and one quarter of Americans have some form of dental fluorosis, a disturbance in the production of dental enamel. And I'm running out of time, so I'll explain how you can remineralize your teeth in one of my next videos.